all right guys so hello and welcome to my new um, mock results analyzer and then um, this time around we have the mock result analyzer coming with a result slip so you can use this to um, track the performance of your students mock by mock and um, you can also um, send or uh, let's say print a resource slip let me open the resource slip uh, the resource slip comes in the form of a BCE result so when we are done with the demonstration using the Excel you'll be able to connect and then all these um, portions will be filled with data you're going to see the index numbers you're going to see the candidate name the type of examination the examination date then each subject comes with a score the grade assigned and then the remarks as it is for BEC and then you see your raw score here you see your aggregate here and then you will generate some kind of comment for our candidates you know for those, those that are doing well we will encourage them those that are not doing so well we will still encourage them and then advise them to uh, push harder so this is actually the add-on for this time around my first release was a free analyzer and this time around we've published it a bit so we've polished it a bit and um, it comes with a result slip as you see so let's get started with the whole system so this is where the teachers are going to fill the data that's after the mock the open this is the data let me let me call this one the database so you can see um this is the dashboard and over here um we can see the performance uh table here uh, so we don't have any data now so you can see everywhere is zero and then this is great based performance this is subject based performance. you can see which subject is doing so well and as we keep entering the data we can also see total number of candidates that are registered in our system and um, this one will display the boys the girls and then here we click to add our record for each subject so before you start using the system you might do the settings or you might do the setup so we go to the register where we go to set up our candidates and then we set up so if you register the candidates for let's say this is your mock one so let's register at least um some few candidates here so we can have um, um victor amu james so Victor Amu James is a male. So we, we enter a male. The age is not compulsory. candidate has number 10 and so these are my candidates when you go home you can see that i have 10 candidates hey i was not even checking but i think it's even five boys five girls so what we need to do let's go back we didn't finish i just wanted to show you something examination time let's say this is mock one mock one and then date let's say you are starting the mock february february or let's say this mock will be written in March. So let's say the mock one is March 2022. And let's say the name of the school is Educon Climber School Complex. climbers school complex then let's see the address is go 
us D901 do do uh. Victor Accra. good so we have this information and we are good to go now if we go to each subject sheet the candidates are there and you can see for example English everybody has nine because we've not entered any score so by default the system sees it to be zero okay all right so what we need to do is to enter scores for these ones so let's say I want to enter the scores at once for all the subjects if I am write a formula equal I think I can I can do that for all of them yes so that it won't be a work so let me let me let me go like this then over here I say equal run between what I'm just doing is just to generate random scores run between and then my bottom score at least nobody should score lo lo less than 40 and then my highest score should be 90 okay so um sorry then I press the enter key so it generates random for me I do this okay so some are, some are doing well some are not doing well so I copy and then I paste as a value so this okay so I think now the scores will change so let's see English this one has 66 math is 86 science is 70 yes so this is what I'm looking for so this is perfect so let me go home now let's go to our broadsheet okay now what we have done scores are filled for all the subjects you can see all the subjects so if I go to broadsheet good so this is my broadsheet which, which shows me um, all the candidates and how they are performing so I can print this now I can print this it's in A3. I, I designed in A3, so this one can be printed. Now, so this is for the broadsheet, and then um, we can go back to so this one. This is the aggregate 9, 25, 18, just like that. Okay, just like that. And is the first in class, second. Hey, there's a tie here, third, third. That's why there's no second. So the same score, but I get 50, I get 19. Okay, so let's go home. Now, our data is filled, and you can see that subject based performance. If you check, um, ICT did well with 70%, um, followed by the 68% for almost like English 68 68 so that is it I think it's not bad and then the grade based performance you can see English uh, English grade 1 had only one person grade 2 4 and it ended at grade 7 okay so that is it you can see RME Hey, what is what happening? I remember stopped at um, with five. Mm, the subject that didn't do well are uh, these. We have grade seven, which is English, math, science, social. Hey, the course I just read up. But that is how it looks like. You know, if you do your manual input correctly, you're going to get your analysis over here, so you can see that mark one. This is how it went. In fact, um, per your request, if you're doing like five mocks, ten mocks, and you want us to design such a way that you can be tracking mock by mock, each student mock by mock, we will just do it for you. But this is just um, a template for all schools. You can just use it to quickly track your um, mock, and then you can print resource slips for your student. And you can also print the broad sheet and can push this one in the, on the notice board as well as give them their results individually and so some schools don't want to do this so they want to give the 
report to the student or the parent. They call meeting, they give them their report or their, their results individually. So let's 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 see how we can um, get our. But first thing first, let's check if we have this. Okay, so the data is filled. So if you go to the broadsheet, that is it. Okay, so it comes to complex and then um, this is it. So mock one. You see the data we filled here is what is being printed on the end of the broadsheet. So if I change this one to mock two, if I change this one to mock two, mock two, and we go to the broadsheet it becomes mock two result sheet. So that is how it is. So what we need to do is to close this so we can print our results. So let's close, click on close, save, save. Then we don't need any of no, this. Then we can open the results slips in Word. Just click on yes. We need to populate. So boom, we have our first candidates here. Um, so index number one. Victor Amu James mock two and these are your results lists and you see this is a comment generated to class of Victor this is a profound performance give it up I get nine so I mean at least some nice comment for Victor and then we have the raw score also here and the raw score is always at 600 over 600 what we do is we pull all the core subjects so if you can see uh, I mean you can try something out here let's let's bring a calculator on let's let's use victor let's use victor in this case let's let's use victor in this case so with victor english is 66 plus social studies is 87 plus rme is not called mathematics score mass is 86 so 86 Plus science also called science is 70. Plus. So the core alone gave us 309. Now let's check the electives. Okay, so BD54, this was not good. So French 89. I think French and ICT both 89. So it will pick the two. Okay, best two electives. So 89, 89. So we say plus 89 plus. 8 9 equals so you can see a 4 8 7 4 8 7 the system is not lying and then we can also check the aggregate 2 we can add up the courses of it so english is 3 plus social 1 which is 4 plus mass 1 will be 5 plus science 2 will be 7 and it will pick best 2 electives so 1 1 that will be 9 so that is aggregate 9 and that is how our system is developed. The way BEC is analyzed, the way we are also analyzing our system. And so, if you're using this template, I bet you, you don't have any headache. Now we can check for all the, so you go to mailings, and all the candidates are here. So this is Victor, and then we can move to the next candidate, which is Sarah, and Sarah had, I get 25. So Sarah, this is a progressively fair performance. You have the potential just push at that you know 25 is not that good but we can't condemn sarah too so sarah should push harder so that's a comment for sarah and then the one who had 18 this is a good performance can do better okay so 18 is not that bad but the, the candidate can still do better so the, the candidate gets a single digit we are going to monitor and then if you want to generate this and print for them just on this click finish and merge <coughs> edit individual document then because we have one to ten candidates say one to ten so you have ten candidates now so click on ok and it's generating their resource list so these are their resource list so this is Victor Amu move on to Sarakoto move on to Koibe Opoku we move on to Asamoah George we move on to Hawa Yakubu. We move on to uh, Maria Mumensa. And 
we get the last candidate so this is how the system works so you can print this for the candidates by coming to file and we say print and you have all your let me zoom in so you have all your report is 100 percent you have all your report cards in here for printing if you order print to print you can also save it as pdf and you can trade later on so this is how the system works and um if you need this template to manage your school um this is just 100 ghana cities uh, we'll customize it for your school and then you can use it for keeps and there's no strings attached the moment you pay the 100 ghana cities we'll customize this one within a space of less than 24 hours less than a day less than 24 hours we'll customize it for you email the, the whole system to you book the extra database and then the word um resource slips made for you and you can start using it for your school but like i said if you want to have um a progressive report and analysis of all the other mocks you'll be doing that is upon request we'll discuss that and then we'll build it for you that you can use it to monitor the progress of your candidate mock by mock thank you for your time and do have a great day this is educon climate infotech bye bye